Hey guys, welcome to this video. In this video I will share 7 lipsticks that you can wear to shine in the daytime. Before we jump into the topic, please take your time to like this video, hit that subscribe button when you want to see more content from me and turn on the notification bell so you get notified every time I upload a new video. For your reference, I have medium skin tone with yellow undertones, so I'm more the warm type. And you won't be able to see it now because I'm filming in the evening, but I have red hair. The first three lipsticks I will share are from Urban Decay. In my view, Urban Decay has some unique colors. In my view, their brand is underrated when it comes to lipsticks. The first one is called Amulet. It is a metallized lipstick. It is, a, it is described as a metallic brick rose. It is such a beautiful color. Why I love it so much is that it gives you a pop of color. So during winter time when everything is sad and gloomy, this is just great. It looks very refreshing on the face. This lipstick will flatter any lip color from fair to dark in my view. Especially fair skin tones don't have to worry about that it will be too dark for them. It is one of my favorite lipsticks. The only thing is I have discovered it this year, beginning of this year, and I, while I was doing the research for this video, I have seen that this is a discontinued shade and I was very sad. But the good news is that they have a liquid lipstick range where they still have this shade amulet. So I will buy that one once this is finished because I definitely want to repurchase this color. It is such a unique color. I haven't seen it with any other brand. This is probably my most favorite currently. It is my red lip for the day. It is Urban Decay's En Fuego. It is a warm toned dark reddish brown. It is a matte lipstick but it doesn't feel tacky or drying. It is more on the creamier side when it comes to the feeling, so it's quite comfortable to wear. I don't think this will look good as a daytime lipstick on fair skin tones. It is more a lipstick for medium to dark uh, skin tone. So let's talk about dupes. So I made some research and um, realized that Charlotte Tilbury's Pillow Talk Intense is quite similar to this shade. I will probably buy Charlotte Tilbury's um, Pillow Talk Intense. The last lipstick from Urban Decay is not discontinued and I will pick this up when I cannot find on Fuego. It is more on the darker side, so I think it won't work with fair skin tones, but will look great on medium to dark skin tones. It is Urban Decay's Conspiracy. It is a plummy browny shade. It is warm toned as well and has a metallized finish. Urban Decay describes it as plum bronze shimmer. MAC has a plum lipstick that is called Baited Breath. They have the same tone. This one is darker and more pigmented and this metallized finish gives it just a different vibe. This is why I actually prefer Urban Decay's Conspiracy 100 times over MAC's Baited Breath. The next one is MAC's Whirl. It is a slightly warm toned light medium brown with a matte finish. So this is a real matte. So this is a true matte. The color suits me well. It's a great color, has great pigmentation and it's a unique color in my view. I like the shade a lot. But the finish, it looks dull and I don't like wearing it by itself. So this is why I top it with the following lip gloss from MAC. It is Spite. Spite is a medium taupe brown with rosy undertones and this lip gloss, I love it. I really think MAC has some good lip glasses or lip glosses and this is one I will definitely repurchase. This by its own is also wearable for the daytime. It gives you this nice glow on your lips. The pigmentation of MAC lip glasses are great. This is why I think they have good lip glosses. This one I will definitely repurchase. The next one is MAC's Taupe. It is a warm toned medium brown. 
It is my favorite fall slash winter lipstick color. I have even bought a, a spare one. This is how much I like this uh, MAC lipstick shade. This one has great pigmentation as well. It's a matte lipstick but it's more on the creamier side again thankfully and it, it doesn't feel uncomfortable or tacky. Last but not least I will show you now a lipstick from one of my favorite lipstick brands which is Giorgio Armani. It is number 200 Bamboo from Armani. It is a warm tone medium brown with a cream finish. The texture ladies the texture is just so great. It's creamy, it feels nice. The color you can wear to work and anytime I don't know what to wear, I wear this lip color definitely. It's a it's a safe bet. So these were the seven lipstick shades. Please let me know down below in the comments which one you like the most and what your favorite daytime lipstick is. I'm really interested to read about your guys' favorite lipsticks. Until the next video, take care, stay healthy and safe. Bye!